Hey Poodles, Happy New Year! Richard Ryder here with This Week on Out TV. On Monday, we've got the premiere of a brand new series, Wild Things. This week, the girls are treated to a bull riding demo from some real cowboys and then barely survive riding a mechanical bull before they're set to work on a ranch. I've barely survived riding things in the past, too. I wouldn't say any of them were bulls. This is the story of three girls on a life-changing road trip. They met in Las Vegas, competing as rivals at a beauty pageant. But when Maria's brother got sick, the girls hit the road to raise some fast cash to help. And they'll do whatever it takes to earn the money. The girls have their differences, but they all share one thing in common. They were born male. It's going to be a wild ride. Premiering Tuesday, we've got the OutTV original series, Operation Vacation. This week, we meet Dakota, a young woman who's been in and out of hospital since she was seven, but she hasn't let that keep her down. In fact, it's her spirit that keeps her family going, and they want to give her a little light in an otherwise troublesome life. Meet the Merediths, an energetic and close-knit family with a love for road trips, quality time, and most importantly, their youngest daughter, 21-year-old university student, Dakota. She was diagnosed with some fairly serious health uh, issues at a young age. She hasn't had a life yet. She deserves it. So I think she just needs an opportunity to get away. Um, so that's why I think she deserves a dream vacation. To hear about what she's had to live with for 21 years, to be able to give this to her, I'm, I just can't wait. On Wednesday, we've got back-to-back -back episodes of The Next American Gay. And this week, it's audition time in New York City as they look for America's next great gay role model. With the first season of The Next American Gay beginning, we had to take a look at some of the contestants to see if they would be a good fit for the competition. I have a role to play, and that's part of the role I play in the scene. Are, Are you, you gay? gay? Yes, sir, I am gay. I am gay. I will stick my tongue down your throat right now. <laughs> Going back to the beard. <laughs> so tell us a little bit about yourself. I think we know enough about him already. <laughs> You're looking right? at the back of my head, sir. Yeah. Well, it's a no this time, but I, I would like to see you again next year. And on Friday, we've got Out for Laughs, starring Bruce Valanche in this fabulous showcase of gay comics, including Trevor Boris, Kristen Becker, and some hack named Richard Ryder. We pulled into some uh, catch a crab, I think it was called, and there was a woman standing on deck, and I was, you know, naked on my deck as I so often am. And she was looking at me. And she went, "Hollywood Squares," which I thought was great because they now usually say, "Oh, Michael Moore." So, uh, <laughs> All right, put out the snacks and put up your feet because our TV's taking you to the movies. On Saturday, we're watching Thelma and Louise. This is a classic tale about an Arkansas housewife and her friend who shoot a rapist and then steal a Thunderbird or what I like to call Tuesday. Thelma, when are you gonna run away with me? Not this weekend, sweetie. She's running away with me. Hey! What time are you picking me up? All right! Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Where do you think you're going? Oh, my God. Get the car. Any reason to believe they've left the state? That's certainly possible. Down, please. Thank you. Just stay there. My Lord. When Miss Louise saw you, do you know her, too? Yeah, I believe she's the woman driving the car. And finally, on Sunday, we're watching Married in Canada. This documentary takes an honest and intimate look at seven couples from the States who come to Toronto to get married. I got on the internet and frantically started searching for uh, a wedding planner of any kind anywhere in the country of Canada. It didn't matter where. It's about confronting this whole notion that I'm different, challenging this societally sanctioned Discrimination. Essentially. It's great to finally have a word. Yes. Uh, this partner always sounds so yes. business like. I'm Richard Ryder, and until next week, that was this week on MTV. Toodles, poodles. Yeah.